So welcome everyone. My name is Angus Levy uh, from Trading with Angus. And today I will be going through AFRIC arbitrage system and also covering some of the questions and answers that people uh, have had uh, through our last uh, Ask Me Anything with our CEO. Um, so let's go ahead. Um, AFRIC arbitrage system. Now they call it the Ponzi exterminator. Basically, um, the CEO uh, is really against Ponzi's in a big way. Uh, and he's fed up. Um, his name is Jessam Michael, and he comes from uh, Nigeria. Now we all know that Nigeria has a very bad reputation for scammers, and he's fed up with that reputation too and is looking to change it. Um, he is a very experienced uh, and well-known um, Forex trader in his own right. He's very wealthy from that. And he's had his own runs run-ins with uh, Forex brokers who try and rip him off as well. And many of us have had that experience in the past. And uh, he was a big advocate of COTPS and... Um, believes that they will come back um, just that they are having, as you can see, we are having so many issues getting everything sorted. I mean, COTPS had over an, a million um, clients. So that's a lot of work to get all of that back and running. Um, so uh, just to go through again with you that, that uh, he's a seasoned trainer and trader with over 10 years experience. Uh, so, uh, over the last two years, he's been developing his own uh, unique strategies that guarantee capital preservation, sustainable return on investment. And he's been using that knowledge to uh, start uh, AFRIC arbitrage system. So AAS uh, is a digital currency trading platform that uses high frequency trading and algorithms to automatically buy digital currencies at low prices and sell them at higher prices to generate returns. As a model focused on digital currency and high trading, high frequency transactions, AAS has been built as a world class digital exchange that has created a top-notch wealth space for investors globally. We have offices in New Jersey, and in fact, a uh, call has just gone out for anyone who is in New Jersey uh, to help with uh, setting up the office in the next couple of days. So if you do come from there and you are free, uh, let me know and I'll put you in contact with um, the right people to uh, uh, get involved with. They also have offices, obviously, in Lagos and Nigeria as well. They are registered uh, in Colorado, and you can see their registration details there. And you can also see um, the uh, file details here. And if you really want, you can also uh, check out the registration live on the uh, color. Uh, Colorado State uh, website. This is the Certificate of Incorporation in Nigeria. Um, so let's talk a little bit more about what arbitrage is. It consists of buying a foreign currency in the market where it is price, where its price is low, and then simultaneously selling it in the market where the price is higher. This is possible since exchanges generally have different prices for the same cryptocurrency. The situation of price gap is used by traders to make a small profit on their trades using arbitrage. So Afrique will be using um, uh, obviously digital currencies such as the Bitcoin or the USDT or um, uh, other currencies. And what it does is it, it scans uh, over uh, six different exchanges at the moment, and they will be expanding it to 21 um, over the next year. And uh, so it scans all of those 
exchanges constantly. And what it's looking for is a price difference. Now, you may be surprised to, to know this, but there can be quite a substantial difference in price between two different exchanges. Uh, for example, I use Binance and I also use another one called Transcript. And sometimes on Bitcoin, for example, I've seen a price difference of up to $500. Um, now, the, the, the problem you have uh, as a sole trader is that you know, you can buy one and by the time you sold it and sent it all over to the other exchange and, um, you know, uh, s s sold it there, the price may have moved again and you could be in a, a potential loss making situation. But with AES, what they've done is they've, they've got funds in all of these accounts so they can buy and sell uh, immediately. And then all the funds are always daily returned to um, the liquidity pool, which is held by Binance. And this is really important that the liquidity pool is held with Binance because uh, th that is the most secure place for our funds to be. Uh, Binance has the best um, security available. So what makes AAS different from other arbitrage trading platforms? Well, for a start, there's 100% proof of liquidity, and that is through Binance. Um, it's a 100% smart contract protocol. Uh, again, this is quite important because um, uh, it means that there is no nobody actually uh, controlling it. It is all programmed and done automatically. So they can't go in and just you know tweak it willy-nilly as they feel like. Um, the, the, the program is self-running. Um, now, they can go in and do some some changes, but they have to be very careful because the, the contract, smart contract, can lock them out if it feels that they uh, have no right to be there. It runs on ASI. That's um, Artificial Smart Intelligence. Um, I think that's the right, the right term for it, or super intelligence. Um, and HFT, that's High Frequency Trading Systems and microservice. Now, I haven't a clue what they mean by a microservice. Um, at the moment, we're running at 1.65 daily return on investment. And for anyone who introduces others, you can get 5% direct referral commission on the daily profit that they make. So in other words, um, if they make, uh, 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 say, $10, you will get um, $5, sorry, uh, uh, 50 cent, isn't it, um, uh, of commission from that $5 profit. Hope that makes sense. Um, and there are no withdrawal charges. Uh, technically, there is a $1 withdrawal charge, and that's uh, made by Binance, but um, the company itself makes no charges on withdrawal. You may have been in other schemes where they've charged up to uh, 3%. Uh, so it's a fully automated system that runs 24 seven, so seven days a week, so you can earn profits seven days a week. Um, and I've already mentioned about the buy low, sell high system. And this is just another example of what it means, but I've already gone through it. So you can buy, uh, and a, a currency at say a thousand dollars worth of it and you exchange it you sell it for 1050 and you keep the 50 dollars profit so that's basically what's going on and it's done incredibly fast and i've shown you and uh, in, in our pinned messages you'll be able to see um uh, on the telegram group uh, that the program in operation there's a video there of it so what is high frequency trading? Well, it's it's known as HFT, which is a method of trading using powerful computer programs to transact a large number of orders in fractions of a second. So you'll see, um, you know, in the video that it's it's running incredibly fast. Um, uh, within seconds, it's taken a few trades. What is an algo or algorithm? Algorithmic trading. Uh, also called automated trading, black box trading or algo trading, uses a computer program that follows a defined set of instructions, an algorithm to place a trade, 
Uh, the trade, in theory, can generate profits at a speed and frequency that is impossible for a human trader. So Afrique uh, offers at the moment 1.65% uh, return on investment each day. So those of you who've been in for a while, uh, you've been able to see each day um, at the same time your profit uh, is returned. Uh, and also any um, profit that uh, those people you introduce to the system, each time their 24-hour cycle is up, uh, you will receive 5% of the profit they made also. So during the day, you'll see that that come in. So what can you expect? Well, let's say uh, you put in $1,000, okay? Um, uh, your daily return will be 1650. Um, over a month, that will be, uh, when compounded, would uh, grow your account to uh, 1,660. And over the year to 3, 392,821. Now, how does that happen? Well, it's thanks to the wonderful thing called compound interest. Einstein called compound interest the eighth wonder of the world. He who understands it earns it. He who doesn't pays it. So uh, in a nutshell, those of us who keep all our money safely with the bank or the building society, we're those mugs who are paying it. Why? Because they're giving us at best 1.65% a year. Okay. And before we get, and they pay out once a year. And before we get that interest, of course, they take away the tax. Now, what's happening at the moment? Well, we've got high inflation, haven't we? High uh, inflation is basically robbing the value of your uh, funds that you hold in the bank. Because let's say the average in Europe and, and the, the US at the moment is between 8 and 10%. Now, if you're only getting 1% to 2% from your savings, you're technically losing up to 8% uh, in your bank. OK, by keeping your money in your bank, you're actually losing money. So uh, don't do that. Take advantage of, of other systems such as this in order to preserve and grow your capital. Now, some people say, well, is this not risky? Well, again, what is the risk? OK. Um, there is no risk in the trading because it is done instantly, okay? So they buy one, sell the other at the same time and take uh, keep the profit. Uh, it's not like an ordinary Forex trade where there's a risk of the price going madly against you. Um, and because it's done literally within milliseconds, uh, there isn't a chance for price to change substantially. Whereas for you and me doing it, there is that risk of price changing on us because uh, we cannot do it uh, at the speed that um, the computers can do it. So uh, AES uses uh, or leverages auto compounding. Now, at the moment, I must say, obviously, that auto compounding is not in place. We expect it, you know, hopefully before the end of this month that it will be in place. And I'll explain in a bit more detail later why that couldn't happen. Um, but let's say you invest $500 on the 1st of September. 1st of October, it'd be worth 816. Uh, November, 1,356. 1st of December, 2,216. 1st of January, uh, 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 it will be worth 3,681. Now, this was presuming, when this was put together, that we were going to start on the 1st of September. I was one of the um, beta testers. And we funded our accounts back in August with the full expectation that it would all be put in place. But of course, um, there were gremlins and everything else. And it took uh, until the end of the year, in fact, before uh, the system was actually ready. And I think, to be honest, it was it went, it, they started a little early because um, when they did uh, start accepting everybody. Uh, several problems happened. One, Twilio um, shut it down because 
uh, they had over, well, just under a quarter of a million applications or signups within the first half hour, quarter of a million. And Twilio had never experienced this before, and they are the um, SMS company that, that we use for uh, protecting the accounts. And they said, ah, there's something wrong here, and they shut it all down. Um, and that caused an awful problem because then the blockchain smart contract goes, uh, I can't do anything. I'm not getting the SMS. Um, so it, it was a bit of a, a mess and it, it had to be slowly uh, started up again. But when they restarted it, uh, they left out an important part of the smart contract, which was the compounding part. And when they went in to try and fix that, the smart contract said, no, um, I'm not letting you in. And that's why we haven't been able to get it started yet. So they have to be very careful and do things in a, a particular way in order to do that. The intention was also to start with um, uh, up to 5% return per day because the system is capable of giving us that. Uh, and again, the smart contract said, no. So. Uh, it's been changed uh, to uh, rotate, and I'll explain that in more detail later. Is there uh, an affiliate program? Yes, there is. It's 5%, and it is only on those you introduce personally. There is no multi-level program. It's purely on those you introduce personally uh, do you get the 5%. So it's vital that you give anybody you talk to your own um, personal referral code, okay? And make sure they sign up with that. Do I need to execute trades by myself? No, you don't. It's all automated and uh, there are zero losses. What is the cycle of a trade in AAS? Well, it's 24 hours. So every 24 hours you see there's a countdown clock on your your account page, and um, uh, at the end of that, um, the profit that the account has made in, in that 24 hours is uh, put into your account. And then once the, um, the compounding is started, what's gonna happen is you will then have a 20 minute window in which to uh, take your profit, withdraw it if you wish. After that, uh, uh, 20 minute window, uh, anything that's left in that wallet is returned to the liquidity pool to be traded. And then the next day, all your profits uh, are returned once more. Now, a quick point on capital and profit. Anything that you add to your account, so uh, your initial deposit plus any top ups you do are considered your trading capital, okay? that money is held in the liquidity pool. You cannot simply go in and take it back out again, okay? It's locked in place. However, any profits it generates, okay, is always going to be available during that 20 minute window, okay? So even if you don't take profits for two or three months, when you come back, all of the profits it's made in that two or three months will be available for you to withdraw up to a limit of $10,000 uh, per day. Um, can you get access to your capital? Yes, you can. But uh, one of the rules is that if you want to withdraw your capital, uh, your account will be closed permanently. Um, you will not be able to use that email or that phone number to set up a new account. So just keep those things in mind. Um, uh, it's not a problem if you want to close your account. Uh, it has to be done through the company, but uh, you, you know your account is closed if you need to withdraw from your capital. How long does a trading cycle last? I've already mentioned 24 hours. Um, so Let's take a look at what happens. If your count is 500, the, box, the bot will uh, execute trades until all of that money 
has been used on trade. So it could be, you know, it could take several trades to uh, use your uh, capital that you have in there. And sometimes even more, obviously, the more money you have in there, the more trades it will take because um, there's not always a huge requirement for very large trades. Um, and at the end of your trade cycle, your $500 plus your profit will go back into the wallet. That's not technically true. Um, uh, the, the 500 will stay within the liquidity pool, but all of your profit, okay, and your compounded profit will, uh, plus your, your referral bonuses, uh, will be available in your cash wallet to withdraw for the 20 minute window. And then uh, once that's up, all that money is swept back in to be um, reinvested for you. Uh, and that is in your benefit. Because obviously you make more money then. What do you need to know about withdrawing? Well, the withdrawal window is always possible at the end of the 24 hour cycle. Between two cycles of trade, there is a 20 minute wind gap to execute withdrawals. There's a $10,000 withdrawal limit per day, but no withdrawal charges except for the $1 uh, that Binance charges. Minimum of $20 uh, should always be in your account uh, at any time. So the minimum deposit is $20, okay? And, you know, if you want to set up a new account, it's minimum $20. The minimum withdrawal is $50. So you need at least $51 in your uh, blue box uh, at the top of your uh, dashboard uh, before you can withdraw. AES can complete three and a half million withdrawals per minute. Not three and a half million dollars, it's three and a half million withdrawal requests uh, uh, per minute. The capital is locked in the liquidity pool, but is available on request. Are multiple car, uh, accounts allowed? Yes and no. Okay, first of all, uh, if the system detects two accounts with the same account details, in other words, email or phone number, both accounts are suspended and the funds are frozen. You are only allowed to use one email address and one phone number, okay? It is vital that when you are uh, setting up your account, that you take your time and input these details correctly. One of the big problems we're having is where people don't understand that, you know, when you put in your country code, like plus one for, for the US or plus four four for uh, the UK or three five three for Ireland. After that, if there is a zero in uh, your, your telephone number, you leave out the zero. So it would be, for example, plus one. And then instead of zero, one, two, three, four, five, it would be one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Uh, because the SMS system has to be able to send out the, uh, uh, the codes to your phone. And if you've input that number incorrectly by adding, keeping in the zero at the beginning of your number, then it won't be able to send it to you because it has the wrong number. Uh, okay, does Afrique Arbitrage have face verification? No, it uses uh, Twilio uh, SMS. And this can be sent to your phone or actually also to your email. What type of crypto does Afrique Arbitrage use? Uh, all deposits must be with USDT TRC20. Now guys, again, this is vital that you put the correct wallet address into your uh, profile, your, uh, in, in, where it says um, withdrawal address. Um, we have had uh, some people by mistake putting in an incorrect address. Some people have even put in uh, their email address um, others put in their referral address, not understanding what they were being asked. Some people have put in a, an, a, a wallet address, which is not USDT TRC20. 
thing about USDT is that there are various um, uh, networks. For example, you can have ERC20 or um, BEP20. Um, or, you know, there's, there's probably up to a dozen different USDT wallet uh, ad addresses that are possible. The only one that is acceptable with uh, Afrique is USDT TRC20. And the way to know you've got the right address is if it has a capital T at the beginning of that address. If it doesn't, then it's more than likely the wrong address. The problem is if you put in the wrong address, it's bound to that account. And one of the safety protocols is it cannot be changed at all. That account is stuck. All you can do is with a new phone number, new email address, set up a new account. And when the internal transfer window is open, you can transfer from the, uh, you know, your, your account from the old one into the new one. Um, now, again, you will need... Um, the help of the admins to do that because uh, you're effectively closing the account. But that can be done. Does the company offer a cell phone app? No. No, 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 no. And you will find them if you go looking for them. They are all fake, all scammers. There is no app. It's all directly um, through the uh, internet. Um, and uh, that links straight into your account. There are fake apps on Google Play Store. Be careful. There are also fake uh, um, web addresses. The only one that is uh, legal, we'll call it legal, is afriquejmarbitrage.us or afriquejmarbitrage.us. Com. There are some out there with Afrique uh, hyphen JM arbitrage or Afrique JM hyphen arbitrage. Okay, so be careful. And um, there are also uh, fake um, uh, telegram groups and WhatsApp groups claiming to be um, uh, the support. They are not. They are there to scam you. Uh, if your salary is your only source of income, you are one step away from poverty. So experience the latest crypto arbitrage technology with Afrique. How do you get started? Three simple steps. Click on the registration link provided to you by the person who introduced you, whether that's myself or someone else. And make sure that it is a proper registration link. I had somebody today who went and used the basically this. They logged into this uh, address and signed up. Now, uh, that means no one gets the referral income. That account uh, is useless to anyone but the person who set it up, basically. Um, and it's not fair if somebody's going to help you. You know, you should give them. It's not costing you a cent give them the benefit of being able to get referral uh, commissions. Um, follow the registration procedure by filling in the required fields, double and triple check that everything is correct before you hit send, okay? I had one person who I know very well who's done a lot of these and um, they three times <laughs> they put in the wrong details. Um, so please just take your time. There's no rush. Take your time. Uh, then you go to uh, deposit in your um, whatever exchange you're using. For example, I use Binance. You you know you go to your your Binance uh, account. Um, click on um, uh, deposit. Choose USDT, then TRC20 network, and it will give you a um a wallet address that's the address that you will put into uh your um uh where it asks for your your withdrawal wallet address 
on your profile. And again, that's really important to double and triple check that it's all correct before you click that button, okay? So thank you, everyone. Uh, that is the presentation as far as uh, Africa is concerned, but I'm now going to go through some other questions that have been raised uh, with you. So if you just give me two seconds while I escape out of this, and I'll go into the AMA questions. So uh, important points, timely deposits. If you want to deposit, you go to your exchange or wallet first, okay? So in other words, for me, it would be my Binance account. I uh, have the money that I intend to send ready to go, okay? Um, do everything you need to do, get to the step where all you have to do is paste in the wallet that you're sending uh, address of the, the uh, that you're sending to then go to AAS click on deposit and put in the amount now remember there's going to be a 0.065% charge okay it'll give you actually the amount exactly uh, to four digits that you need to send all right so uh, Look out for that. So in other words, if it's $100, it'll be $100 and uh, six, uh, 65 cent. Um, and uh, also allow for the fact that you're going to have one extra dollar charge for sending um, the, the funds to your account. So in, in my Binance account, I would have to um, uh, put in $101.65 that I'm sending, okay? If you've failed transactions, send your proof with a screenshot of your transaction hat, hash and send it to the admin Ambrose at Fondle Bliss for Life. Ooh, it's an interesting one. Uh, it takes about 72 hours to fix your issue. So what, what that means, how do you get a failed transaction? It's if, in other words, you've you've taken more than five minutes to send the funds, okay? Um, the the wallet address times out automatically. And uh, if you feel you're not gonna make that five minute window, please cancel uh, the deposit request and just set up a new one. But really, you know, it's, it's not that difficult. Um, and usually it only takes a minute to set it all up and have it sent. Uh, Joe's saying, uh, wait, Angus, if you have to close your account to start a new one, will you be able to get the interest accumulated or will you lose it? No, you can get everything. Don't worry. Everything that, that it's built up, you will be able to uh, transfer over. And again, it would be uh, this guy. I have a feeling that will be the one who will help you, Ambrose. Okay. So let's see if I can get this to move on. Hmm. Oh, okay, I was at the wrong wrong one. I'm gonna start at this this end. Website accessibility. There has been a series of attacks. In fact, um, up to last Friday when the AMA was on, um, they had sixty nine attacks, sixty nine separate hack attacks, and I'm not talking about just the, the, the simple one. Um, it is uh, hack attacks, uh, serious ones intended, aimed at trying to get in and rob our money. Uh, ro uh, read um, the referral code you will be able to find in the Telegram group. I'll show it to you in a minute um, but, uh, where to find it, but it's in the pinned messages. Um, now, uh, the attack did not work because this is... Um, you have to think this is Jess and Michael talking. The attack did not work because we came prepared. We did not host our system in the cloud or leave uh, our liquidity pool open so that to fall victim to attacks. So their efforts to penetrate our security were in vain. Please excuse the um, spelling 
and language and wrong grammar here, um, just to say Jessam's first language is not English. Um, this is how AAS was designed. The more it is attacked, the more the system will shut itself down. That is a security measure that was programmed in. So you will have noticed that the uh, quite regularly um, the site is down. Why? Because it's been attacked and the, the whole thing is designed just to shut down, poof, so that uh, nobody can get access until that attack has finished and then it'll open up again. Um, it is for our protection. Is it a pain? Yes, it's a pain, but it's, um, you know, again, to protect our money. Those of us who are in COTPS, uh, the account was hacked and it's they haven't been able to get it back up again. We can still see the funds sitting there. There's over 7 billion sitting there, but the company, for whatever reason, hasn't been able to rebuild the system yet. Um, it's, as I said before, over a million people, it's a nightmare. Um, before the platform was built, we studied our other platforms and their loopholes and weaknesses, and we built our platform better without those weaknesses and loopholes. What happens when the site is under attack during the times we are doing business on the website? Money does not go missing in the blockchain. This is an important thing to understand. When the site comes back up, any withdrawals that you've asked for, they'll go to your wallet and the, the pending withdrawals will be able to be pushed to your account from the blockchain uh, by you sending your email to us to rectify the issue. So if you were in the middle, for example, of, of doing a withdrawal and suddenly it goes down, don't panic. Um, you'll be able to uh, get it. Uh, and if it hasn't appeared in your exchange, um, when it comes back up, uh, just contact again uh, Ambrose and he will help. In order for hack attack, uh, to, uh, they need 542 computers. Otherwise, they're not able to, to hack uh, the computers. So it's only serious hackers uh, have a chance of, of uh, attacking us. Uh, what does withdrawing profit look like? During your withdrawal window, you can withdraw any profit made by your account. So it's anything that's in the dark blue box uh, at the top of your um, dashboard. Uh, after your withdrawal window is closed, the system will pick up whatever is left after you've made your withdrawals, and that will be added back to your capital to trade and make profits. You will not be able to withdraw your capital unless you apply to withdraw it and have your account closed. Internal transfers. Once the settings have been done and compounding percentage and inter in internal transfers have been implemented, uh, uh, you will be able to do so. Now, for those that have made mistakes on their accounts with phone and email addresses, let your account trade as it is for now. Once the fixes have been done, apply for your capital, shut down the messed up account and create a new account with a different phone number and email. Put your funds in the new account with the correct information. This is because you cannot do an internal transfer with an incorrect email or phone number. If you've messed up uh, with entering the withdrawal address, Again, let your funds trade for now. Then when the fixes are integrated, you can create a new account and do an internal transfer to the new account to make withdrawals of your profits. The only thing you can edit in your back office at the moment is your password. Um, so uh, again, you know, we're quite new. We're, we're only, what, three weeks since uh, the, the uh, company has started trading um, and uh, there have been and there will be probably for another month or so um, teething issues and uh, they're you know they're trying to cope with all of these hack attacks as well as getting all of the systems running smoothly um, so just 
you know, don't worry, your, mon your money's not lost. It's there, it's trading away, it's making money for you. But you will need to, if you've messed up, open up a new account. And whether that means, you know, getting a second SIM card for your phone or whatever, that's what it's going to need to do. Um, internal transfer for limits. The internal daily limit is 10,000 per day because it counts as a withdrawal. The 10,000 per day limit will increase in time as Binance watches AAS business operations and as member wallets grow and the community grows. So the 10,000 limit per day is not one put in by Afrique. It is one put in by Binance, okay? Uh, they're in control of the liquidity pool. They are in control of the um, withdrawal uh, portal as well. They're handling it all. And these are their rules, not Afrique's. As they said, they, you know, they will look at it. I mean, I, with my Binance account, I think I'm able to withdraw some like two or three million per day. Uh, the reason our capital is locked. Now, if we were to have access to our capital to withdraw it whenever we wanted, that means AES would have our funds in a hot wallet hosted on the cloud. Now, this means that hackers would have easy access to hack the system and steal investor funds. AES learned from other failed platforms that building a system that way does not work. So AES decided to build the system on the blockchain and lock investors' funds in the biggest, most secure exchange in the world, that being Binance. So, so that hackers and no other human would have access to those funds. That ensures 100% safety of investor funds. Trading also does not happen in the front end of the platform. It happens in the back end. So uh, your trading and return on investments are never interrupted when the website shuts down due to a hacker attack or for any other reason. So never fear, just because the site isn't visible doesn't mean that your the trading isn't going on. It is going on and your, your, your fund will be growing uh, at all times. Using a VPN on AAS. Please don't use a VPN on the AAS platform as it will potentially um, have you um, blocked. Uh, things that are working on that should be fixed in the next week. Top-ups being picked up in 24 hours instead of 48 hours. Now, uh, guys, um, one thing I've learned about uh, our dear friend Jess and Michael is that he is a bit like Elon Musk, okay? Uh, his time frame is not necessarily a real time frame. His intention is to have it all up and running uh, within the week, but we're already at Wednesday. You know, there's only another two days before that week is up. I honestly don't see it happening. Uh, I may be wrong, but I don't. Uh, let's say by the end of the month to be on the safe side. Top-ups are being picked up in 24 hours then instead of 48 hours. So anyone who does a top-up at the moment, uh, it, goes, it goes through uh, to the second cycle before it gets added to the trading pool. So let's say um, you've got two hours left on the clock, okay? You do a top-up. Um, the funds will stay in the wallet until the following, in other words, the second um, uh, trading cycle has finished. So it can be 24 to 48 hours, but it's definitely always on the second cycle that it uh, will be then swept out and into the trading platform. But they're hoping to uh, reduce that back to just 24 hours maximum. Failed withdrawals get automatically returned to your back office for you to place a new withdrawal instead of emailing admin 
on the next on the issue. So yeah, they're they're going to fix that so that if uh, for any reason uh, a withdrawal fails, the money automatically goes back into your your account and is ready for you to uh, automatically try again. Is there a way that a different security system um, can be added other than the website shutting down? His answer is it's better to shut down the site than to allow hackers to take over the website or to hold it for ransom. And that's what happened with COTPS. It was a ransom uh, attack and they weren't going to pay out. We have over five servers that work independently of each other. If the site is shut down, we've designed the platform to never stop trading and our return on investments uh, keep coming in. The more they attack, the stronger the security system will get. But we have what we have is the best and the way we built the site is the best option. It's amazing how many people think they know better. Um, will we be able to get rid of withdrawal limits? I've already covered that. Withdrawal li limits were never our plan, but because we are, are working with Binance, they are uh, uh, instructing the limits. They will that they, they cannot allow us to operate with unlimited withdrawals because of global regulatory bodies. Right now, we're at 10,000 per day. Later, AAS can apply to increase the withdrawal limit per day. So there, there are certain countries that have limits um, and they have to abide by those. Uh, what's the procedure for someone who wants to withdraw his capital? We did not design the system to hold back capital completely. We did not give room for you to have direct access to your capital, because if we did, the hackers would have taken your capital yesterday during the global attack. The capital is locked in the liquidity pool in order to keep bad actors out. Once the blockchain opens up and you want to withdraw your capital, you have to apply by sending your AAS email address and your AAS wallet address. Um, again, to Ambrose that I've already mentioned. And once we send your info into the blockchain, it will send your funds in two hours and then immediately close your account. Um, and in less than one minute, it will close your account for life. That email address and phone number for that account will no longer be able to be used ever. Okay, so choose wisely. Timely deposits. If you want to deposit, go to your exchange. Hold on two seconds. Uh, if you want to deposit, go to your exchange or wallet first. Do everything you need to do. Get to the step where all you have to do is copy your wallet address and then go to AAS, click deposit. Oh, I think I've covered that already, didn't I? Um, and then go to AAS, click deposit and fund your account. Fail transactions, send proof of a screenshot of your transaction hat, hash to uh, Ambrose and in 72 hours, they will fix it manually. Uh, that ladies and gentlemen are all of the AMA questions and points that were covered. Um, so uh, let's see, we have Joe Salmon. So when you open a new account because of whatever reason, you can still withdraw money to the new account, just the profits, I presume. No, you'll be able to withdraw your capital as well. The old account would be the principal account, but the new account will be able to receive money from, okay, you could do that as well. You, you can have, you can have um, a second account. Um, so you can leave your old account running and just do internal transfers to uh, a new account and then withdraw from that. That is possible, yeah. So this is going to be available every day. If yes, can I use your ref same reference link? Yes, you can. Or referral link? Yes, you can. Uh, no problem. Um, uh, good question and thank you. 
So yeah, you don't have to close the account. It's just that you have to do internal withdrawals once that element is, is set up to your second account. And from there, you can then uh, withdraw to um, your correct uh, wallet address. If, for example, you put in the incorrect wallet address. Good question. Thank you, Joe. All right, uh, folks, I'm going to open it up now. Um, we have a few minutes left before we are to the hour. I like to try and keep this within the hour. So anybody got any questions, you can open your mic or you can type into chat, whichever you prefer. Or if you'd like to make any compliments, you're welcome to do that too. Okay, I'll give it another few seconds. And if there's no questions, uh, we will leave it there. And uh, I'll say thank you very much, everybody. And uh, good night. And uh, I will see you uh, next week when we'll probably do the same thing again. Take care, everyone. Good night. Bye-bye.